don't you want to come in here? Come on, this room's no fun. Let's leave, baby. Why would I want to do that, Mia? This place looks fun. I mean, look at this. You got, you got cribs, you know, some rocking horses, some children playing around. They're having fun. I don't see no problem with this. And what you got hidden in here? Mia's children. Aw. Oh. I guess she used to be a mother of an orphanage. Orphanage? Why I say it like that? Orphanage. Right? She took care of the kids, fed them, taught them music. They had fun extracurricular activities. Activity. Oh. That's not good. Oh. Oh, that's... That's bad. Oh, no. What the fuck did I just witness? <laughs> oh. Oh, no. Well, at least you got this fun toy chest in here. Now you definitely don't want to go in there. That's a party killer right there. What are you talking about? It's just a, you gotta bring toys to the party. It's a play date. People are gonna have fun. Come on, let, let's check it out. Darling, what are you doing down here? The party is upstairs. Lucky for you, I have my nightmares under control. We can take you to our world of play and trust me. Now quick, let's get back to the party, okay? Darling, if you're looking for the makeup room, you've gone to the wrong place. I don't like it here. Well, that was a party killer. I'll just... I'll just be on my merry way then. Let's just ignore that. <laughs> okay, well... Back to the episode. Well, that was interesting. Welcome back. Ladies and gentlemen, to more Psychonauts. Where we last left off. We, uh, finish our levitation training course. It was... It was a pain in the ass. But now, with this wonderful, magnificent power... We can fly! Somewhat. Kind of. Not really. Technically. It's falling with style. But, with that... A bunch of... Oh, shit. <laughs> a bunch of wonderful... Areas we can traverse places we can get to that we've never been to before. There we go. And now, we need to, with our newfound powers, we need to rendezvous with uh, Lily tonight after going back in the brain tumbler to help Dogen. But before we do that, this is a perfect time to run around the camp and get some things done that we need to do and show some things off before it's too late because there are there is a part of this game in which you will not be able to interact with uh, the campers for some time so with that said I want you to take out your bacon mmm bacon hey looks like you're ready to take on a new psychic power Ready to come back and get your new merit badge? You're damn right I am. Yes. Alrighty then. Let me lower my headset. It's In so loud. In recognition of your hard work, dedication, and mental agility, I'm proud to bestow upon you the official merit badge for telekinesis. <laughs> With telekinesis, we can use our minds to grasp an object and then throw it. Go ahead, try it yourself. I like throwing things. I throw it like this. <laughs> no. Now who said to let that go? Not me. 
I, I got it. My bad. I'll do it this time. Oh, good throw. Now, let's see if you can make it through the hoop. You sound like my dad. Hey, I've been thinking about that. Why that guy hates psychics so much? What do we ever do to him? I don't know. Why are you so old? Well, psychics killed his whole family. Cursed them and all their descendants to die in water. Whoa. Yeah. Talk about baggage. Tell me about it. And the weird thing is, I'm pretty sure he's actually psychic himself. Ha! Huh. Cuckoo! Well, you can work on him when you get home. For now. Damn, that's sad, man. Oops. Raz, you're sad. You're a sad person. You bring my mood down. Bad vibes. I'll shoot some hoops. Oh, that makes shot. everything better, right? So you do that again. As they Let say, ball is life. Say. Bingo. Okay, Forgo your academics one. to play a sport. Don't be shy. <laughs> now, That's not true. Let me show you something. Pick that trash can up and aim your toss at the side of the caravan. If you want to play a sport professionally, you actually have to focus on your academics. By the way, fuck the you, caravan. caravan. Kablooey! Throwing something against a wall is a little more destructive than tossing it around on the ground. Yeah, and it's the gamer's way to say oh, that no. you're angry. You Another throw things. One of my now, how'd that get in here? Looks like we're in luck. He doesn't see you yet. Why don't you smash him on the head with that handy trash can? Come on! Use telekinesis to pick up the trash can and throw it at that sensor. I'll throw you at that sensor. Nice. Now, set me down easy and go pick up something that won't blow up your head if you make it mad. All right, all right, you win that one. You win that one, I'm sorry. Sorry, see, I'm doing what you told me. See, he's dead now. I killed the thing. Are you happy? Looks like the trash took him out. <laughs> Next lesson, we'll work on your snappy one-liners. I'll work on your snappy one-liner. That sounds... I take that back. Very nice. Now set me down easy and go pick up something that won't blow up your head if you make it mad. I'm sorry. Where would you like me to take you, Agent Crawler? To the strip club. <laughs> take me to, uh. I don't know. Take me to church. <laughs> Alright. Take me to, uh. There's a lot of things we gotta do. Take me to the fucking. Geodex's isolation chamber. Yeah, that Bring that thing. Bring me near the geodesic psycho isolation chamber. Roger that, Ranger Crawler. So first things first, like I said earlier, I want to show off the whole Maloof thing, right? Just in case you guys are having a hard time getting that trophy. Wow, it's a tunnel that opens onto a system of catacombs. I <laughs> let me go. What to do with small bully assistant? Geez, I don't know. Could you put him in that deadly Nelson you were talking about? Could. On such tiny opponent, all blood might drain out ear holes. Ah! Some big ass Shut ear holes. Up, Benny. On the other hand, blood from constricted trunk could rush to tongue. And? Tongue swells, pops. Most blood drains back down throat. Interesting. Less mess that way. Mouth stuffed with giant tongue can't scream. So quieter. Ah! Uh, shut up, Benny! You have something less drastic? Well, could use half Deadly Nelson. What's that? Like Deadly Nelson, but less dying. How much less? Maybe uh, half. What happens <laughs> the other half of the time? Opponent leaves. Spends the rest of short life praying for death. Hey! Can you hear me down there? Maloof? Shut up, Benny. Seriously, Maloof. I apologize. A call off your goon, and I'll never bother you again. Ever. The thing is, Benny, you're never gonna bother me again either way. So you're gonna have to offer something a lot better than that. Like what? Any ideas, Mikhail? Know when you think about giant hairless beer? No. Out of ideas. Preparing Nelson. Well, wait, wait, uh, maybe, uh, yeah, m maybe I did see something like that. Uh, give me a minute to think. You ready to talk, Benny? Hold on, it'll come to me. The kid was raised to kill. Having trouble finding those really deep, valuable it's, arrowheads? It was a little well, disturbing. I've got a great deal on a slightly used dowson rod hey, up here. You guys the main aren't going store around taking people's brains out, are you? Dig them up Not yet, but, uh, 
maybe we should do some market research on that and, and see if there's a demand for that service. You're fucked up, kid. You're fucked up. You're not going to, uh, kill Benny, are you? Difficult to say. <laughs> He's like, I'm not sure. Maybe? Mm, killing sounds great. Sounds like an easy situation. An easy, uh, problem solver. Alright. So, there's a couple of things we gotta do around camp. One is the scavenger hunt. And the other one is the fucking collecting the side cards and shit. Uh, there's various campers to talk to to get nice little pieces of dialogues from, and the other one is the most annoying thing in this fucking game ever, which I personally really don't like. It's the dowsing rod. We have to get the dowsing rod so that we can get a lot of arrowheads, so that we can get our upgrades and our web, our fucking cobweb duster. Oh, I wonder what those two are doing. Let's check it out. Uh, That's weird. Those guys just left all their stuff out here. Wonder what happened to them. Okay. Where is the way up there? I completely forget. There's like a place I can climb, right? Now here we go. I don't want to grab this. <clears throat> My voice is getting a little scratchy. There we go. Want to jump over here? What are you two doing? This is it. Yep. I'm so happy, Clem. Me too, Crystal. It's going to be great, isn't it? Super great. We're going to be so powerful, aren't we? More powerful than you can imagine. Oh, I can't wait. The sunset's beautiful, isn't it? It will be more beautiful afterwards. When we've done what we're going to do. Yes, when we finish the project. The people down there look like ants, don't they? They are ants, Crystal. Cruel, cruel little ants. Oh, Clem, it's not their fault. Still, they're gonna be sorry. Yes, that's true. They will all be sorry. Are, are you two hey, okay? Is that Nils down there with Chloe? Whoa, that's weird. Oh, man. I've gotta tell Elka. What's the point? I guess soon there won't be much point to any of this, will there? Not when we finish the project. You two are starting to scare yes. me. You hear about Elton and Milka? No, oh, what? Totally a couple now. No way. I thought Elton loved Lily. Yeah. Well, and I thought Milka loved Quentin. Well, I guess if people's love was something you could trust, we wouldn't be here now, would we? Good point as always, Clem. Well, are you ready? Just one more minute. Let's just watch the sun until it sets. Just pet, just pet All the right. rabbits, Lenny. Let's let people have one last sunset before things change forever. Forever. What the fuck is your problems? What are you guys doing up here? Raz? Didn't see you there. We're just looking at the sunset. Shh. Just wait until he leaves. Huh. The sunset, huh? It is a nice sunset, isn't it? Yes. yes. Mental cobwebs getting you down. <laughs> okay. Well, you two have fun. The main lodge you two crazy campers. Come on up and score your Got a side challenger. I'm about to be level 30. Oh my god. That's gonna be so great. We're gonna be so powerful. But before we do that, let's go grab ourselves a dowsing rod. We need it. We're gonna have to use it. And it's not gonna be fun. Hey, anything new in the store? Take a look. <laughs> Just take Whoa, a look nice inside this book. Now with that, Reading Rainbow. Now that, now that, now that, now that, now that, 
All right, there we go. Dowsing rod. You can use it to find Scientanium arrowheads. Equip the dowsing rod and watch it change color and vibrate. Tau lets you know that you are getting deep arrowhead territory. And then you gotta what mash the fucking triangle button. All right, so. Let me tell you how this thing works. It's gonna be a pain in the ass. You're gonna have to take out your dowsing rod, right? It's gonna make this annoying ass noise. It's gonna persist forever. Now, when it glows blue, that means you're getting cold. When it glows pink, or purple, I guess. I'm saying pink, I don't know why. And your controller starts vibrating like crazy, like over here. Where's the, where's the purple? There we go, this should be a good area right here. You're gonna mash the triangle button. And then you get your arrowheads, you get a shit ton of them, right? Instead of walking around looking for purple dust and, you know, clicking triangle, getting one arrowhead at a time, or killing a bunch of sensors. Now, here's the annoying part about this. Sometime, the tracker will pick up on multiple spots at the same time and fuck you up. And if you're not close enough, you try to mash the button, it's not gonna go up, right? So, I guess what I'm trying to say is, uh, it's fucking, I can do it. You can't beat me. You beat me. I give up. Where is it? Oh. Hello? Oh. Oh. Ooh. Oh. Uh. Ha ha. Uh. 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 Right here? Right there. All right. So, here's what's going to happen. We're going to... I'm either going to skip ahead... I'm not picking up anything. Shut the Must fuck up, Raz. I'm either going to skip ahead, or I'm going to speed it up to where we get enough arrowheads to get what we need. Because you might as well get it now and get it out the way. It's going to be a pain in the ass. We already need 800 arrowheads for a goddamn cobweb duster, and we need I'm 400 the for the patch. And then uh, we need They're more for, for like... You. Keep you know, side challenge markers or whatever, side now. markers or whatever the fuck, later down the road. So, I'll basically see you guys in, I don't know, 30 years? Oh. Forgot. Here's one of the, um, whatchamacallits. The scavenger hunt items. So, make sure you pick that up on your way. Back to hunt for more arrowheads. Ah! It's a psychic bear! Run for your lives! Alright. So here's a psycho bear. Psycho bear? Psychic bear? Psycho bear? He bears bears. What you're gonna wanna do is get your power kinesis. And your laser beam. You wanna aim? Set that motherfucker on fire. If you can. These psycho bears hurt like a bitch. Setting them on fire will distract for a bit. They will pick you up with telekinesis. And you wanna ah fuck 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 Get away from me! You monster! There you go. Alright. That's pretty much how you deal with them. You get better ways to deal with these guys later, and there's stronger enemies out there. By the way, while I'm here, let me just grab my arrowheads. Oh my god, that was a lot. Oh, and here's a challenge marker card. Bam. So, uh, back to the grind, I guess. All right. Back in the main lodge, we now have enough arrowheads. <laughs> a lot of arrowheads to get what we need, and a couple of uh, extra goodies here and there. So, uh, let's hey, do that. Anything new in the store? Take a look. Ooh, that's my last cobweb First thing duster. you want to do is Take grab this mind, cobweb duster. Clean it. up. Sold to the big-headed kid with the gloves. <laughs> to the big-headed kid with the gloves. All right, that is necessary for 100% of the game. You can play the whole entire game. Actually, that's a lie. That is a lie. That is a lie. Forget what I just said. I believe you have to use the cobweb duster maybe a total of two times throughout this game. What so you're going to have to pick it up more. regardless. Now, with that, now, ah, now here's something every young psy cadet needs. The mental magnet. 
I think this helps bring uh, orbs and shit to you, so we're gonna buy that. It's gonna help us out. You know, quality of life improvements. That's always good. It automatically will be drawn towards you from a distance. See? Instead of chasing them down. Increases your survivability. Now, this is completely optional. But you gotta be ranked 30 to use it. So instead, we're gonna buy this. I'll take it. Sold to the big headed kid with the gloves. What else can I do you for? Now, one psychor. Alrighty then. Two psychors. Three psychors. What else can I do you for? That's it for now. Alright. Alright. So I believe Come it's every Jeez. ten cards plus one psychor oh, equals a level. Uh so we're gonna have to run over to Agent Crawler's basement. Fun basement. The old man's fun basement to uh, exchange those in to get us to rank 30. But before we do that, okay. TV hacky sack. Yes, hacky sack. Oh no, they're all brainless. Hi, Raz. <laughs> Vernon, you're okay. Yeah, we're great. Me and my pals Kitty and Frankie are just hanging out telling stories and watching the boob tube. TV! Vernon, look at them. They're zombies. It did seem kind of weird when they let me get this close to them. And then they didn't mind when I talked all through the show. Kitty even agreed to go on a date with me, more or less. We're gonna play hacky sack. Keep an eye on them, Vernon. I'm gonna go figure out what's causing this. Roger that, Raz. Did you ladies know one of the bloodiest battles of the Civil War was fought at the shore of this very lake? Yup, it's true. <laughs> what the it fuck? <laughs> back when this place was still an Indian summer camp and burial ground, a group of Ugin soldiers got separated from their regiment. Night was falling, and they were cold and scared. Of Dracula. Boo. <laughs> of what? what? They were just terrified of getting shot. Though I'm sure any of them with any sense were afraid of Dracula too. They stumbled across an old building. You could still see it on the far side of the lake. So they decided to spend the night there. Little did they know it was an abandoned Indian insane asylum built on a caveman burial ground. Yup. Little did they also know that a cursed fish lived in the asylum. All right, all right, Vernon. All right, Vernon, you're done. You're done. We're done here. You're done. We're done. We're going. We're leaving. Bye, Vernon. Bye. I'm not gonna. I got time. I got other things to do in my life. I'm not gonna waste my time doing them there. Alright, so, now, you may want to run around and collect some Psy cards, like I'm about to do. More importantly, I'm going to collect maybe like two or three. How many do we have? Alright, so, about like six I'm going to collect. But, overall, I would love to show you every location of every fucking, uh, whatchamacallit, Psy card, right? But I just don't know all the locations. The way I always do it is wait till I get to end game, and then grab them all until my rank reaches uh 101. And that's how you know that you got all of them because you're at the max rank of the game. I believe it's 101, anyways. But so for right now, just kind of grab them as you see them. But while we're doing this, we can. We can finish the... I believe we have all the abilities that we need. Actually, that's a lie. No, we don't. We don't have all the abilities that we need to finish the um, the quest. For, uh, for the scavenger hunt. That won't be until, like, way later down the road, I think. We need at least one ability that we're, uh, that we're missing right now. I think it's... Uh, I think it's after we do a certain level with the with the milkman. Oh shit. I missed that. I didn't mean to miss that. I am the milkman. My milk is delicious. <laughs> it's my favorite line in this game. You people will learn 
You will learn what that means when the time comes. The true hero of the American people. I wish the milkman was still a thing. Oh, look, one of the items. Eagle Claw, nice. It's always great to grab him while we can. All right, what are we missing over here? Gotta grab some cards. I hear the bear losing its mind. Oh, come on, get up there, Raz. Anything over here for me, Mr. Janitor? Nope, I don't think so. Oh, look at this. A campfire. Why can't I start it? Why can't I start the campfire? That's weird. 30. Alright, cool. Oh, there's a thing up there. Might as well grab it. This is how it begins. This is how the collect-a-thon begins. You just go like, oh, there's a thing I want. Guess I'll just grab it. And then you start collecting and grabbing, and you can't stop yourself because you're like, there's one over here too. And then what's over here? Oh, just an arrowhead. Okay. Nothing important. Got some cards over here as well. The gamer in me won't stop. Oh, hey, look. An item. <laughs> that we need for our scavenger hunt. Now, if I believe correctly, if I believe correctly, if I remember correctly, I believe another card. If I remember correctly, I believe... Oh, God, another fucking... <laughs> scavenger item. I need I need help. I need help. I need help. I have a problem. I have, I have a problem. We're getting out of here. We're getting out of here. We're not doing this right now. We're not doing Raz get out of here. We can't be here right now. What I wanted to do was I wanted to head over here. Because these guys are up to some shit. You know, Chloe, for a chick whose face I can't see because she's always wearing a helmet, you're pretty cute. I'm not human. Someone's been playing Mass Effect. But you are the girl model of whatever it is you are, right? Affirmative. At this point, that's totally close enough. Man, what smells like butt? Oh, hey, Nils. How about you and your butt and its odor take a hike before I puke? But... It'd be a real shame if you had to leave your butt here because it was anchored to my foot. Now beat it! Hi, Chloe. <laughs> How is it, uh, in, I mean, <laughs> you know, what's up and stuff? Bobby, we need to work on you a little. Ew! <laughs> They're dating! Why are these kids so horny? What's good with them? What the fuck is your problem? Oh no, I can't get through here. Can I burn it? Nope, that won't work. Good thing I have... What's the button? Here's the button. Good thing I have telekinesis. Can't get a good grip. Bad thing that I have telekinesis. It will not help me. Hey, I can levitate. Wanna see my merit badge? Uh, that's great. You can just float up on out of this forest then. Because the forest, it's off limits. Now get! Oh. You're right, I could just float up. Thanks for telling me that. There's a card! I have a problem. Uh, let's go! Damn it. Physics. Get, get up there. Yeah. There we go. Up, oh, get, get out. There we go. At this point, I'm grabbing so much. Hey, man, how's it going? <laughs> I'm grabbing so many challengers that I may not even need to hit the crawler. But that's what I'm gonna do, anyways. Take out your bacon. There's that smell again. All right. Do you have any advice? I need to regroup at HQ. Take me back. 
Take me back. I want to go back. All right. So down here, we're going to use this now, machine. Before oh. you go electrocuting yourself, let me tell you how these babies work. Now, this beauty here is a mental cobweb detangler. Oh, I know what those are. Mental cobwebs are... You see, when an area of your psyche is neglected for too long, mental cobwebs form. Now, up in the camp store, they sell a very special device known as a mental cobweb duster. You can take a projection of it into the mental world with you and use it to extract any cobwebs you find. The duster stores the cobweb's psychic energy on the real world side. Your eyes so are very shiny. You what you collect back here. Hook it up to the loom and weave that tangled mess into something useful. Like a card from a side challenge marker. Which brings us to this fella over here. You put nine side cards into this guy. How do we teleport? One side core. Also sold in the company store for a nominal fee. And it will kick out a bona fide side challenge marker, which will earn you a promotion to a higher rank. Rank up enough, you'll earn new psychic abilities. You got it? Put my mental cobwebs in there, and my side cards and cores in there. Yep, basically. Have fun. How'd you teleport up there? <laughs> well, he explained it for me, so uh, I don't have to explain it. So we're just going to do it. We have three of these, 30 cards at least. One, two, three. There we go. We have enough for a new power, and more importantly, which is not actually more importantly, but more important to me, we have enough to change the color of our levitation ball. Because even though orange and green are it's pretty cool, it's nice. It's good coloring for Raz. I actually really appreciate it. I want to go for something that expresses me a little bit more. In recognition of your hard work, dedication, and mental agility, I'm proud to bestow upon you the official merit badge for invisibility. All right, well, I think now we have all the abilities we need to finish the scavenger hunt. Well, <laughs> I thought you'd get that later. Well, we have invisibility now. Oh wait, no, we're still missing one. We're still missing one ability. I okay, forgot. Let's play a game. Oh, let's play a game. Another sensor. Playing a game right oh, now. No, you're out of ammo. No, I'm not. You are now. Here are the rules. Take this guy out. But if he sees you at all, you lose. Go get him. I'll get him. Where'd he go? Where did he go? He's yeah, invisible. Yeah. Oh, well done. Now that's the power of invisibility. I think I've heard the kids around camp refer to this technique as uh, silent but deadly. Uh. That's correct. All right. Now we need one more ability. We need. This time I mean it. It's all coming back to me slowly the more I play this game. Now we need one more ability to be able to get everything. And the, uh, and the whatchamacallit, the scavenger hunt side quest. So for right now, I think what I want to do is, first of all, head back to the school store. Where would you like? To grab our important, not so important item, but important to me. Let's see. Where's the school store? Campfire, uh, parking lot, main lodge. There we go. Oh. Away, computer. All right. Yeah. Is that a challenge card? <laughs> I sound like a drug addict. Is that a, is that a cigarette? Can I, can I have one? Oh man, no offense. No offense to anyone smoking. You should quit. Alright. Oh, listen to that. That's actually pretty good. Kitty! Oh, kitty. Alright, you made it pretty bad now. Alright, now you're done. You're done. No, you're done. Hey, anything new in the store? Take a look. Now, with All right. that, you can change the color of some of your psi powers, like your levitation ball. What have sold to the big-headed kid with the gloves? 
All right, talk to Crawler when you want to do some colorizing. What else can I do you for? Now, we have Junior mm, Fluffs, which basically give you your health back, but you really don't need them. They're not that important. Take it. So, so at this point, kid with the gloves. So at this point, just keep buying Psychors. That's all you're really going to use your money for. What else can I do you for? Excellent choice. What else can I do you for? All righty then. What else can I do you for? All righty then. What else can I do you for? All righty then. What else can I do you for? Sold to the big-headed kid with the gloves. What else can I do you for? Sold to the big-headed kid with the gloves. What else can I do you for? Put that on my tab. Ah, uh, sorry, Mac. No can do. We only trade in hard, cold, titanium arrowheads here. If you don't have enough, why don't you run around outside a bit and dig some up? Or crack That's open some natural now. vaults. All right. Go get more airheads and come on back. Support All right. Your local what the hell? Are, what is this? Are these sandwiches? What is that? Are they just containers? Is that just salt? What? I can't... Are they supposed to be milk cartons? All right, whatever. Now that we have our colorizing orb, which is not really that important, but important to me, because I like it. I like it a lot. Hey, guess what? I'm the one playing the game. I get to make the choices, okay? All right, cool. We're cool. Great. Back to the video. Delicious. All right. I want to change my Can levitation I change color. The color of my levitation ball? Like, say, to what? Oh, you know what I want it to be, don't you? Don't you even question me. There was never a doubt in your mind. There are a lot of colors, but I... Huh. Okay. Hope that makes you feel pretty. It does make me feel pretty. Fuck Nothing you. Nothing more to rip crawler. Look at that. It's nice and pink. I like it. I like it. I like the pink color. But there's nice options. You know. Oh, I can shoot while I'm on the levitation ball. I never knew that. Or something new every day, huh? All right. Now with that out the way, let's head over to the uh, kids' cabin. See what's going on over there. If I had some momentum with my levitation, thank you. I'm a chef what else should I be? Please don't take off.